Hi guys, um, this is a first for me. This is a uh, EDC pocket dump and this is a response from my buddy uh, Shiny Knife. Um, I've never been tagged before. I'm kind of new to uh, YouTube. I've been doing this for about two months and um, I was watching one of Shiny Knife's um, videos today and um, I didn't even hear my name mentioned quite frankly until he told me about it later that he tagged me in the video and uh, it's just uh, about doing a pocket dump but anyway uh, before I even get into that I would just like to say thank you to all you guys that uh, have watched my videos and um, helped me out because I am like I said totally new to YouTube I've been doing this about two months clueless really about how <laughs> any of this works when he first said I was tagged, I thought I said something inappropriate in a comment section um, for him, but now I know what it means. But um, I certainly really, really do appreciate the shout out um, and and uh, that he did and being tagged. So anyway, here goes uh, my EDC pocket dump. Um, so this is what I have on me. and. Um, I travel from New York to Connecticut. I have businesses in both states and uh, so this is going to be in two quick parts basically. One video but two parts. So while I'm in Connecticut, um, I of course always have my wallet with me. So wallet, I have my car keys with me, um, I have my cell phone with me, I have my many flashlight with me uh, while I'm in Connecticut. Um, I also enjoy cigars. Sometimes I have these little minis. These are uh, Romeo and Julieta. Can't really see. I guess the light's too bright. Let's see. Romeo and Julieta. These are mini, mini cigars. They're really good cigars. So I have my cigars with my lighter with me. Put those over there. And I have, as my primary choice of weapon today, I have my Beretta Nano, which is um, loaded with six plus one. So that's what I have uh, with me today, uh, the Beretta Nano. I carry a spare magazine in this little, um, I don't know what it's called, Blackhawk, and a little Blackhawk magazine pouch, so I keep that with me. And then uh, in my front pocket, that's normally appendix carry or four o'clock carry, in my front pocket, um, I had with me today the North American Arms 22 Magnum. Um, so in this little holster, I did a video on this gun. And um, I have a watch that I uh, carry with me, I was wearing. And um, then I also have one of my favorite knives, which is this, um, it's the uh, Emerson design by Kershaw. I think it's the 006, and I think it's a great knife. It stays in my front pocket, and it's easily deployed when you pull it out of the pocket with that wave feature, it just catches right on. So I have that on there. And um, so this is, and then I also have this little Gerber, which I uh, keep with me. This is just a Gerber. I'm not sure what uh, what model it is. I got it on Amazon. It's just a little, just a knife for cutting little uh, things. And uh, I have all that with me. A lot of times this is not just in my pocket. It's in this bag, which is an older, over the shoulder bag that my wife bought me. Let me just uh, zoom out a little bit on that. So I hate to be, uh, you know, the term man purse, but sometimes when you have a lot of stuff, um, you need it. Normally I keep the knife in this little compartment on the side here. I keep a gun sometimes here if I don't have one on my purse, in which I 99.9% .9 do. And then if this is strapped over my shoulder, if I'm walking, I leave this zipper open so I have quick access to a pistol. But uh, a lot of times I carry this because there's a lot, a lot of stuff I'm carrying. So let's see. So this is all what I have for my, um, when I'm in Connecticut. Now, when I go to New York, I get rid of all that. And this is what I carry in New York. This is, like I said, the Gerber. That's it. 
um, I guess I have the keys and the wallet and the flashlight, but um, no guns, no knife, even though it's under four inches, it's, uh, I would be arrested for that. The guns, forget about trying to get a gun permit in New York, that's just never gonna happen. And uh, so that's it. And to be honest with you, I really wouldn't even wanna be caught with this in New York City because uh, police like to arrest the good guys and um, they like to let the bad guys run rampant. And, you know, I did have a really uh, dear friend that was uh, arrested and he had a knife about this size. It wasn't even a assisted opening or anything like that. It's just an old fashioned little pocket knife. And the guy was walking with his wife. He did have a clip on it and a policeman spotted the clip on his pocket and he got arrested and it was a big production. And you know, my friend said, why don't you just keep the knife, throw it in the garbage, it's a $10 knife. But they insisted uh, on arresting him and it became a big production. But anyway, so um, that's, that's, that's my New York carry. So flashlight and a knife. So welcome to uh, the wonderful state of New York um, where they like the criminals to be armed and the good guys to uh, have a little pen knife. So anyway, that's my um, that's my tag, I guess, uh, back to Shiny Knife. And uh, again, I really appreciate him, um, you know, doing this for me. And I uh, hope you guys find this interesting. Thank you very much. And um, I will uh, post this soon. Have a great day. Bye.